This man who is alive for 400 years because of a curse. Who gave this curse to him and will he be able to be free from the curse? Watch full video to see this. In the beginning of this movie, we see a king named King Aguirre along with his soldiers coming to take a magical flower from a magical tree known as the Tree of Life in the enchanted jungles of the Amazon. However, the jungle recognizes their evil intentions and attacks them, causing King Aguirre and his soldiers to face severe consequences. But then, some tribal people from the jungle come to their rescue. They take the king to their tribe and save his life. Now, King Aguirre meets the leader of those tribal people, King Sia Arrowhead in Leader's Knack. Seeing it, the king understands that it is the key to reach the Tree of Life, and he starts demanding the arrowhead from the leader. However, the tribal leader refuses to give it to him, as the arrowhead is a symbol of their tribe. Out of anger, King Aguirre sets fire to the entire tribe with his soldiers, and in grief, the tribal leader curses them, condemning them to be forever trapped in the same jungle. Now we are shown the scene after 300 years, we see Dr. Lily and her brother, Mac, who are discussing the search for the Tree of Life in front of some people, and requesting permission to see the arrowhead displayed at the city museum. However, the museum's owner refuses to give them the arrowhead. Upon hearing this, Dr. Lily leaves and goes to the city museum, where she meets a German prince and realizes that he has come there to retrieve the arrowhead. Learning this, Lily steals the arrowhead and escapes, Angry Prince orders his men to pursue her. After that, we see Lily and Mac, who make a plan to journey to the Amazon's jungles with the arrowhead. The scene changes, and we are introduced to a man named Frank, who is a ship captain and takes people on jungle tours aboard his ship. Later, Frank is approached by a man named John and asked to return some money he had given to Frank earlier. But Frank doesn't have enough money. That's why John takes the engine of Frank's ship and goes to his office. After John leaves, Frank sneaks into his office. At that moment, Dr. Lily comes to meet John because she needs a ship to go through the river and into the jungle. Lily mistook Frank for John and asks him to take her through the river and the jungle, and Frank agrees to take her since he needs the money. Just when they are about to leave, John arrives and reveals the truth to Lily. Hearing this, Lily gets angry with Frank and refuses to go with him. Frank apologizes and convinces her to accompany him. Suddenly, a jaguar appears and attacks them. Frank bravely faces the jaguar and manages to scare it away. Impressed by Frank's courage, Lily agrees to go with him. After that, Frank goes to get his ship. But some time later, Prince's men come to capture Lily, who came to take Arrowhead from Lily. Lily escapes from those people. Just then, Frank arrives with his ship, bringing Lily's brother along, and Lily boards his ship. They all start to leave that place. But at that moment, Prince appears, who is sitting in a submarine and starts firing shots at Frank's ship. However, they manage to escape from there. Afterward, due to the approaching night, Frank stops his ship at a place and sits with Lily, having a conversation. Suddenly, Mac comes running towards them, and behind him is the Jaguar, which is about to attack John's office. Lily realizes that the Jaguar belongs to Frank, and he had lied about it, making her quite angry. On the other side, we see Prince, who uses a rope to enter a deep cave. Inside the cave, he see King Aguirre and his companions, who had turned into stones due to a curse given by the tribal leader. Then, Prince pours water brought from the Amazon River over them, transforming them back into humans. Afterward, we witness Frank's ship getting stuck in a storm and falling down a large waterfall, making everyone extremely scared. After many attempts, Frank finally manages to regain control of his ship and prevents it from crashing. He then stops the ship at a location to repair the damages. Now, we see Lily, who enters a room inside the ship and finds a book that contains information about the arrowhead and the tree of life. From this, Lily understands that Frank also wants to find the tree of life and that's why he wanted her to come along. Suddenly, Frank appears at that moment. Seeing him, Lily confronts him about his lies and how he used her for his own purposes, as he also wants to reach the Tree of Life. Frank admits that he had tried to find the Tree of Life many years ago but failed to locate it. While they are talking, they hear a voice from the ship's intercom, and they discover a group of wild tribespeople outside. These tribespeople capture them and take them to their tribe's location. 
the leader of the tribe asks Lily to give them the arrowhead. However, Lily refuses and fights back against the tribe's people, impressing their leader. The leader then mocks Frank for another failed plan to get the arrowhead, and Lily realizes that all of this was Frank's plan. Furious, she slaps Frank and decides to move forward without him, as she can no longer trust him. Frank apologizes and asks for one last chance. Just then, King Aguirre arrives with his companions and they attack him. One of King's men captures Lily and takes away her arrowhead. Seeing this, Frank goes to retrieve the arrowhead from King Aguirre, and they start fighting. In the process, Frank successfully retrieves the arrowhead from Aguirre but, at the same time, King Aguirre thrusts his sword into Frank's heart, causing him to fall. As he falls, he tosses the arrowhead towards Lily. Now, the leader of the tribe informs Lily that she must take the arrowhead across the river to the other side because King Aguirre and his companions cannot cross the river due to a curse. Lily goes across the river with her brother, saving her life. The next morning, when the sun rises, Dr. Lily returns to the same place to meet the people of the tribe. There she finds Frank's body, which deeply saddens her. But, just then, Frank comes alive before her, and the sword is still inside his heart. Now, Frank tells Lily to remove the sword from his heart. When Lily saw this, she got scared. Frank reassures her and says he will tell her everything later. Now, Lily leaves her brother Mac with the people of the tribe and sets out with Frank to find the Tree of Life. On the way, Frank explains to her that he has been alive for the past 400 years and was once a companion of King Aguirre. Therefore, he also carries a curse and wants to find the Tree of Life to break it. On the other hand, we see that the German prince captures Lily's brother Mac. Then Frank and Lily reach the place where the Tree of Life should be, but they find nothing there except water. At that moment, Frank sees something beneath the water and dives in, finding a way forward. He returns to Lily and informs her about the path. Both of them dive into the water. Lily rotates a wheel attached to a door, causing the water to decrease and revealing a hidden city. They are delighted with the discovery when suddenly the German prince arrives, threatening to harm Lily's brother. In response, they hand over the arrowhead to the prince. Then the prince captures all three and moves ahead. After entering inside, they see a considerably large tree, but it's completely dried up and lifeless. Prince threatens to harm Lily and asks Frank what they should do next. Frank advances and notices an arrowhead-shaped mark on a stone. He places an arrowhead in the mark, and suddenly the moonlight falls on the tree, reviving it with life once again. Lily informs Frank that when the moonlight fades, the tree of life will wither again and slip into dormancy for many more centuries. At that moment, the prince moves forward to take a leaf from the tree, while Frank reaches Mac. He defeats the prince's men and saves Mac from them. Meanwhile, Lily climbs up the tree to pluck a leaf, but slips and hangs on. She tosses the leaf to Frank just as the moonlight vanishes, causing the tree to wither once again. Now, King and his companions arrive before Frank, and the prince urges the king to kill Frank. Surprisingly, the king kills the prince instead, paying no heed to his words. A fierce fight ensues between Frank and the king's men as they attempt to seize the leaf from him. On the other side, Mac tells Lily that Frank gave him the leaf. After that, Frank's ship loses control and collides with a stone lying there, so that all those people come to the other side of the river and because of their curse, they all become stone and now Lily comes to them. She is deeply saddened to see Frank turn to stone. Now Lily puts the leaf of the tree of life on Frank's mouth, so that he gets cured and turns into a human again and all those people start to be very happy and with this the movie ends here. How did you like this movie? Do tell us by commenting. And do subscribe to our channel.